My name is Joyce and I grew up in Hong Kong eating a lot of Cantonese food. I love eating all different types of Cantonese food. It has a special place in my heart. Let me tell you more about it. So China actually has eight different types of cuisine regions. Some of the most popular ones that you might have heard of include Fujian, which has um, more braised cooking, slow cooking methods. You also hear a lot about Sichuan, which is in the northern part of China. It has more spicy foods. And also another popular one is Cantonese cooking, which is where I'm from in Hong Kong, which is in the southeastern part of China. A lot of their cuisine consists of uh, very basic cooking methods with the hot wok or with a steamer. So back in the day when fuel was really, really expensive, we try to use less of it to cook. And in order to achieve that, you have to cut up your vegetables and your meat into really small pieces so that it'll cook up faster in the hot wok. Um, and up until today, we still do the same method. Some of the typical ingredients of Cantonese cooking and a lot of these ingredients you'll find in all Cantonese refrigerator include ginger, garlic, soy sauce, sesame oil, cornstarch to thicken up the sauces and also meats like chicken, beef, seafood. Um, we also use vegetables like peppers, broccoli, snow peas. In Cantonese cooking, we use a lot of ingredients that some people may be put off by, for example, like chicken feed or tripe, um, but they're really, really delicious if you cook them correctly. The reason why we use these ingredients to begin with is because in China's history, there was quite a bit of famine, so we had to use all the ingredients possible. Us Cantonese folks take eating very seriously. We love to eat because it brings the family and friends together. Um, and actually a lot of the food that we eat have a significant meaning to it. So for example, noodles means long life, eggs means good fertility, uh, chicken means marriage between two families. Fish, which is called yu in Cantonese, means abundance. So we love abundance of everything. Abundance of money, abundance of uh, health, abundance of family. When I say we take food seriously, we really do take food seriously. We don't just eat to survive. Um, a lot of Cantonese people, we believe that food is a bat will bring you balance in life. So with your health. So you hear a lot of people say yin yang and what it means is cool foods, cool foods and hot foods. So you can't eat a dish with only cool ingredients in it and you can't eat a dish with only hot ingredients in it because that will make your life unbalanced. So a lot of dishes you do see the vegetables and the meat because it combines the cool and the hot will bring you a balanced life. 